Do you ever feel like your weight is a perpetual yo-yo? You take off a few pounds. Stop the diet. They sneak back. You take them off again. Poof. In a few months, you're back to looking for the next trendy diet. If that sounds like you, then you're not alone. According to the American Obesity Association, in the United States at any given time, 29% of men and 44% of women are trying to lose weight. This means that about 45 million Americans are actively dieting every year. The yo-yo dieting is a phenomenon which occurs with people who typically want to lose a lot of weight quickly. They're taking on very restricting and challenging diets and they lose a large amount of weight in a short period of time and then resume their previous eating habits which causes them of course to regain weight and not only do they regain uh, to the point where they started but above and beyond that so you get in a cycle of losing and gaining weight. In today's world we know that there are a number, increasing number of obesity related diseases especially heart disease and diabetes and so on and therefore if we can maintain a healthy weight by diet and exercise, we reduce our risk for developing these diseases at a later stage. But what is a healthy diet? There are so many different ideas of how to eat right. Sometimes it's difficult to know what to do. To give us a better idea, Marianne can provide insight on what a healthy diet consists of. A healthy diet, of course, is a balanced diet, and you want to be careful to maintain a high amount of nutritious packed foods such as fruits and vegetables in your diet and be very careful of high calorie foods such as fast foods uh, because if you take more calories in than you will use of course you will gain weight so typically you want to maintain a healthy balance it's also very important to watch portion control uh, sometimes we're not really aware of how many calories we are eating so we really have to look in detail to this and maintain smaller portions to keep this healthy balance Having new weight management tools to help us reduce weight and maintain our target weight can be an extremely important addition in our battle of the bulge. Fortunately, however, there are some very good weight management tools that can help you take off the weight and keep it off better than ever before. One important breakthrough in the effort to lose pounds and maintain a healthier weight is a new natural weight management ingredient called conjugated linoleic acid or CLA. You can find this functional ingredient in many different shakes, capsules, and weight control bars. Conjugated linoleic acid, also known as CLA, is a fat which is present in our natural daily diets. We eat it in milk and beef and dairy products. It has now been shown that this fatty acid can help to maintain a healthy diet and help maintain weight. And therefore, it is important to increase our intake of this particular fat. However, the levels in these uh, natural products are quite low, and therefore we have to supplement our diet in order to get an adequate dose. And now there are products available on the market so that you can achieve an optimal dose. When you take CLA in the body, it prevents the uptake or storage of fat, which would normally occur when we eat high-fat diets, and it redirects that fat then to the muscle tissue where it's burnt off or oxidized. So you build your muscle mass and you tend to improve and have an overall healthier shape. Losing weight and working to achieve your ideal weight is not simply a cosmetic issue. Many studies have shown that being overweight, especially if you're considered obese, can put you at a higher risk for many serious health challenges. Dropping excess weight can help lower your cholesterol, reduce the risk of heart attack and stroke, and dramatically increase your energy level. In the U.S., if we want to look for a healthier future, we have to find ways to improve our weight and maintain that weight so that we have to reduce calories, control portions. We certainly have to be less sedentary and get out there and exercise.